Ukraine says Russia attacks on three sides, controls two more towns. As Russia steps up its offensive in the Donbass, Ukraine says it has just lost control of two more towns in the east. Ukraine's defense ministry announced on April 27 that the country's armed forces had lost control of two more towns in Donetsk and Lugansk, Zarechna and Zavody respectively. Earlier, on April 18, Ukraine also announced that Russian troops had taken control of the city of Kremina in the Donbass. According to the announcement of the Ministry of Defense of Ukraine, Russia is launching major attacks on three fronts. The Russian military also secured logistics and received more supplies. Despite losing control of an additional part of the territory in the Donbass, the Ukrainian Defense Ministry said that the Ukrainian army repelled nine Russian attacks in Donetsk and Lugansk, as well as destroyed many Russian weapons. The Ukrainian Defense Ministry said that Russian troops had advanced north from Barkhano, the town south of the city of Izium, to gain control of the town of Zavody. To the east, Russian forces advanced to break through the Ukrainian lines and take control of the town of Zarechna. From the south, the Russian military is still trying to establish a land corridor connecting the mainland in Ukraine to the Crimean Peninsula. At the same time, Russia is also trying to control Zaporizhzhia, the city bordering Mariupol. On the same day, April 27, the Russian Defense Ministry announced that the Russian army attacked a large Ukrainian weapons depot in the city of Zaporizhzhia. A large arsenal, mainly consisting of Western weapons that aided Ukraine, was destroyed in Zaporizhzhia, the Russian Defense Ministry said in a statement. Earlier, Russia also announced the destruction of six railway stations in western Ukraine. These railway stations play an important role in helping the West supply arms to Ukraine, the Russian Defense Ministry described. According to CNN, 